Hi, and welcome to this Polaris FID tutorial video. In this video, I'll show you how to calibrate the analyzer through the docking station. Once the Polaris is on and ready to start the measurement, from the method menu, I'll select Read Span by pressing Enter. I can decide to use the integrated span cylinder or an external gas tank. On the display will now appear the span gas concentration and I'll wait a few measurements to be sure to get a stable value. By pressing Enter you will stop the measurement anytime and go back to on the method menu and perform the calibration. Meanwhile, uh, you can see here on the docking station um, a display with uh, two different temperatures. The bottom one is the temperature set by the manufacturer and on top the actual temperature of the oxidizing catalyst. This value is found during factory calibration and it is the temperature at which the catalyst has its best performance performance. So the end user does not need to change this value. Ok, so the measure uh, is completed and uh, now I can press enter and go back to the method menu. So here are shown the uh, average values. I press continue, saving data, no, and then I can select calibrate. Now, on the screen, you can choose between two options, detector response and cut efficiency. It is not necessary to select cut efficiency because this is the value that is set by us during the factory calibration in order to find the best working temperature for the catalyst. So there's no need to change it for the end user. I will then select detector response response and decide if I want to perform an internal or external calibration by using the sampling system or the gas cylinders directly connected to the Polaris. In this case I have the integrated 1 liter cylinder so I select internal. If it is necessary I can change the span gas concentration and finally I select run calibration. Now the instrument will start analyzing the span and on the display will appear the values of the area below the FID peak, which is correlated to the carbon concentration on the span gas. At the end of uh, the calibration the instrument will show the old area and the new area and I can choose to accept or not the new value. In this case I want to accept the new cal and now this specific method has been calibrated with the proper span gas. Pollution Analytical Equipment The answer to your on-site detection challenges